Hey guys, what is up? Andrew here from Mr. AC Pilot, and welcome to a series in which we are going to create our very own Minecraft animation. Before I say too much more, this is what we will be creating. Okay, so I'm excited for that. I'm going to jump straight into the modeling section of this video. So I'm just going to open up Minecraft, create a new world. We'll just call this Island Animation. Uh, we want to be playing in creative and with a super flat world. Uh, so you can either follow along with what I'm doing on screen. Um, again, I'm just modeling out a very basic island that you just saw in that video. Uh, if you want to just skip to the next video and get straight into the action, you can download My World from the description along with any of the other programs that I'll be using. But um, just for now, I am going to be talking a little bit about programs and uh, just basically setting up our uh, scene and our workflow for this little animation. Okay. So I am planning to go through all the stages of producing this, including the animation, the lighting, the shadering, and the rendering. So you guys will get a complete overview of how to go about creating not only this simple example, but hopefully you'll be given the tools so that you can then create your own animation and come up with your own ideas in the future. All right, and that leads me on to talking about the programs which I'll be using. Now, obviously, I'm using Minecraft for the modeling section. Uh, my 3D program is Autodesk Maya. Uh, that's just a personal preference. You can really follow on with any other 3D program. Um, some of the popular ones you guys are using are Blender, 3ds Max, and Cinema 4D. Um, a lot of people ask which is the best program. And at the moment, um, programs are really becoming quite similar. Um, the program doesn't matter as much as the ideas you are actually coming up with as an animator. And uh, so it just really comes down to a matter of personal preference. I would recommend Maya, but um, again, you can use really anything that you want. Uh, in saying that, if I'm doing a tool or something on screen that you can't find in your own program, if you just hit up Google, I'm sure there is a wealth of information, um, just, you know, probably just a button in a different location. And, uh, you know, Google is your best friend when it comes to this sort of stuff. All right, so um, as I said, Maya and Minecraft. Finally, Mineways, which is the program we'll be using to take this world that we're creating and actually turn that into its own 3D object. And that's generally how we get, or how I get at least, all my worlds and builds into the, uh, the 3D program. Okay, um, I will be answering questions shortly after releasing this. So if you have any questions, um, even if it's a different program, just uh, let me know in the comments and I'll try and get back to you, try and be as helpful as possible. I just uh, felt like I would share a bit of knowledge with you guys and um, this has been highly requested. So here it is and uh, this will probably be a five-part tutorial series. Anyways, guys, uh, that's about all for now. Um, I'll see you guys in the next lesson.